Let me just, let me, I'm, I'm impressed with Judge Barrett. Uh, she brings uh, scholarship and a good temperament and integrity to the court. Those are the things I look for in a judge. And she brings something else. She has the advantage of an education in Tennessee and in Indiana. And that legal and educational background, I believe, will strengthen the court by diversifying it. Delighted to be here uh, with our nominee for the uh, Supreme Court, and uh, I believe that she is going to be a tremendous addition to the court. You know, she's proven herself in the hearings. Anybody that had a chance to listen and watch knows your experience, uh, your abilities, your keen intellect. Uh, <laughs> love the picture of you holding up the empty <laughs> notepad that everyone got to see to say this is all coming from your brain. <laughs> Not from, and all the senators had their big books of all the questions. Uh, you were magnificent. You're going to do a great job on the court. We're looking forward to, uh, to voting to support you next week. Thank you, Senator. Senator, do you have any concerns about the previous law on school board? I am absolutely delighted with her nomination. The people of Wyoming are so happy that she's been nominated because she's true to the Constitution. And uh, that's the whole Wyoming way of thinking about things. Um, it really is about the Constitution, and we're delighted that you've been, in, uh, been nominated by President Trump. Thanks. So Thanks. Thank, you. Thank you all for coming. Uh, I am delighted to be here with Judge Barrett, really looking forward to our meeting together. I've been very impressed with her background, uh, her record. Uh, perhaps I was most impressed with her judicial temperament in the face of some tough questioning at the Judiciary Committee, uh, her patience and her calm. And uh, I'm just delighted that she is willing to step up and, and serve her country in this way. I look forward to the opportunity to talk about some issues with her this morning. Thank you all. Senator, do you have any concerns about Judge Barrett? Barrett? I'll, I'll get you in the hall. I'll get you in the hall if you guys have questions. Right, Sounds good. Well, I'm so inspired to meet you. Really uh, looking forward to voting to put you on the Supreme Court. Uh, you're an inspiration to me, um, someone who broke barriers myself, but you're a barrier breaker and uh, your just um, incredible career, uh, your brilliance and your just uh, mo role model that you are for women and girls and men and boys uh, <laughs> is something that I think is going to inspire so many people. Um, just really looking forward to seeing you serving on the bench and your gift to America. Thank you, Senator McSally. Bill, I'm uh, looking forward to the uh, dialogue uh, with Judge Barrett. Uh, obviously, she had a phenomenal uh, hearing last week. Uh, got a chance to see not only judicial temperament, I guess, come out last week, uh, to get a chance to see a, um, a relaxed judge that's just answering questions and sticking close to the law, which I appreciate that, but I also got to see you as professor last week and teaching people about the law and walking through that. But I've got quite a few questions that I want to be able to walk through as well. Some things we didn't get a chance to dig into much during the other hearings on religious liberty, uh, which obviously came up in your first hearing uh, a lot uh, for the circuit court uh, on this issue of can a person of faith be able to serve any place they choose to in the government, which traditionally that's been yes. Uh, I want to be able to still talk about that a little bit more. We need to talk about tribal law and uh, I want to talk a bit more about precedent and what that really looks like or antitrust issues. And uh, so there's quite a few issues that I still want to be able to walk through today, but looking forward to the dialogue uh, to be able to go through those. And thanks for your service, for you and your family. Uh, it's been a pretty remarkable journey to be able to get to this point for your entire family to be able to do that. And uh, so grateful for your service before and then looking forward to the service in the days ahead to the nation. Thank so thanks. Thanks, y'all. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. you know, is that possible? Anyway. Thank you. We're so honored. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Folks, we uh, appreciate your being here. I'm just so excited about this opportunity. We had the opportunity three years ago to, uh, to visit, and uh, uh, the big winner is the United States of America. Thank you very much. Thank you, guys. All right, we're back. Thank you, folks. That's it.